Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. I've recorded and uploaded over 2,000 videos on YouTube. That's a lot. I don't have a life. <clears throat> people have asked if I would ever go back and caption some of them so that people who could not hear my voice, and believe you me, if you ever heard my voice, you kind of wish you couldn't. You're not missing anything. Trust me. Anyway, people have asked if I'd go back and caption the videos using YouTube's caption tool, and I just don't have the time, unfortunately. But there is a way that you could caption your own videos or potentially even my videos using this tool built on Google's App Spot, which is a place for you to take uh, Google's app engine and build your own tool and have it hosted without paying anything. So you can try a tool and it might work, it might not work, and you could throw it out there for the world without having to worry about web hosting if you're a developer. So one developer out there decided to put together this, captiontube.appspot.com, that's A-P-P-S-P-O-T. Uh, this particular resource was submitted by Austin Saracen, and I believe I've heard Austin's name before or at least his name looks familiar to me. No matter, uh, this is a tool that you can incorporate your YouTube videos within. So you go there, uh, you, uh, you can sign in with your uh, Google account or your YouTube account, and it will show you all the videos that you have in that account. You press a button to import that video, and then you're taken to this particular page. And what I've got in front of me right now is the most recently uploaded video, Do You Want a Tablet for Your PC or Mac? I'm going to mute the video though. And then, so it's playing back right now over here. It's got the annotations. Uh, I can choose to press pause if I want, add caption, caption text, blah, blah, blah. I can choose the caption start time or the caption duration uh, and then save the caption. So now I've got that particular, particular caption saved. It's down here in my timeline. And I, when I'm all done captioning that entire video, I can press export options. It gives me the option for the sub viewer, the dot sub, or the sub rip format or the dot SRT. I can choose down, download the captions as a file, email the captions, or copy and paste the caption text. So in theory, you could do this with your own videos, or you could do it with the videos that I have recorded and uploaded to YouTube, and then email me the captions if you'd like to see captions put in there. Of course, I'd hope to trust you that you would not, you know, throw in some wacky words. I wouldn't take captions from just about anybody. I mean, I'd want to have good captions in there. So it's a, it's a chance to kind of play along, uh, add something to the videos. Maybe the, the video that you like most, if you want to do captions for that, cool. We'd love to incorporate them. Even if you want to do this for your own videos, awesome. I just don't have the time. I mean, it would take a lot of time for me to go through and caption my rambles. Man, I... Jeez, if anybody tries that, seriously. I mean, I, I'd ask it, but I could not expect it. Serious, I mean, I would, wow, wow. Captioning th even this part of the video, wow, 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 wow. My email address, chris at perillo.com. Feel free to drop me a line if you know of any other really cool or handy resources to pass along. Well, that's why you would email it, to pass along. The... We've also got a community of tech enthusiasts at geeks.perillo.com. And, of course, we got the chat room. Typically talking tech. How often are we talking tech, guys? I kind of, I forgot. Kind of, oh, that's right. 24 hours a day, seven days a week at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.